How are we doing today? Yeah. Should we read some books? Yes. Could you read me a book about data government, Pop Pop? Of course I can. How about The Little Red Data Hen? Yeah. Once upon a time, in a legacy barnyard, there was a little red data hen. She knew all her data could help all the other animals do their job better, but they never paid enough attention. One day, the little red data hen called all the animals into the barnyard. Who wants to create a data-driven utopia of interoperability where our insights flow freely from workflow to edge across integrated ecosystems? Asked the little red data hen. Not a lot of buzzwords. I know. Who wants great data? Asked the little red data hen. I do, mood, the sales cow. I need to cross-sell and upsell. I do, Burf, bark the finance puppy. I need to maintain regulatory compliance. I do. Oint, the marketing pig. I need better targeting for our customer journey. But the little red data hen had a big problem. All our data is a mess, she said, and it's stuck in silos. And because she lived on a farm, those were real silos. What are silos? That's a place where people keep data separate from other data. Why? It's a problem everywhere. So they don't get mixed up? Yeah, so they don't get mixed up. I'm seeking stakeholder engagement, said the little red hen. Who will help me collect and catalog the data, she asked. Not I, moved the sales cow. I need to focus on revenue. Not I, barked the finance puppy. I don't see the immediate ROI. Not I, oinked the marketing pig. My priority is brand equity. Oh, very well, I'll do it myself, said the little red data hen. And she collected and cataloged all the data she could from all the silos and migrated it. Did she do ETL? No, she did ELT. Oh. Uh -huh. Now, the little red data hen needed more help. Who will help me govern, structure, and steward the data? Not I. You're in charge of data, not me. Not I. That sounds like an IT job. Not I. Just upgrade your software stack and that will take care of it. Oh, very well. I'll do it myself, said the little red data hen. And she went off and established a data governance skunk works. And because she lived on a farm, she used a real skunk. Yeah. Finally, the little red data hen thought she had everything ready to go. She had taken the data from the silos. She cataloged, governed, structured, and stewarded the data in a hybrid cloud data lake behind the barn. She could use a data mesh. You're right. Who will help me leverage all our trusted data, asked the little red hen. I will. Now I have customer 360. I will. Now all our numbers tie out. I will. Now we can reduce customer churn. Finally, the whole barnyard can have consistent KPIs. They all mooed and barked and oinked. The little red hen was so happy and excited. Unfortunately, it was too late. By that point, the legacy barnyard was disrupted by a data science-based farming startup that used predictive analytics to provide an innovative crop as a service offering. What's that mean? They had to close down because they waited too long to fix their data. Why? They just couldn't get the stakeholder engagement. The finance puppy was given away. The sales cow, the marketing pig, and the little red data hen were all sold to a food service operation. Don't be like a bunch of silly barnyard animals. Managing data is the job of the whole farm. The end. Such a funny book. Pop-Pop, is data the new oil? That is a different story.